Location, the Great Permian. Over 252 million years ago, This large, lumberous creature is called a Demetrodon, and it is very hot at this time of the year for them. We are in the Permian, and at this time, life is coming to an end. Remains of these creatures have been found in many places across the globe, specifically in North America, and recently in Germany, in certain Permian shale sites. These immense and dangerous creatures are fierce predators to all. But in reality, they are actually quite social to one another. Here in this valley of the Permian, there is much water sources for which these animals can drink from. But it won't last long. These deposits are rare, and it's very lucky that this group has stumbled upon these. Yet they will tick away, hour by hour, minute by minute, and become just grains of sand, forgotten in time. But for now, the Demetrodons drink. Will it be their last drink? Who knows? All they know is that water is life. The amazing sail of Demetrodon stands high on its back. Its narrow quills have a large skin that form over them. Reasoning behind this is suspected to be to cool them, or to keep them in shade. Others suggest that it is for mating purposes, as to put on a very good show for the ladies. Double O Dimension. Whatever its use, it certainly makes this animal very distinctive, and very eye-catching, especially to its prey. As most lie in the sun, and relax, some of them decide to have a little bit of fun. Except they are soon exhausted, as the heat at this time is immeasurable. Temperatures upward of 40 degrees Celsius are currently in effect, and these creatures must remain near the water in order to survive. Many have taken up swimming inside of these shallow little pools. But soon these shallow pools will inevitably become their graves. Days soon begin to pass, as the hard beating sun goes around, and around, and around. Each passing day more moisture being leaked from these distant pools, creating a dry, lifeless landscape. There is no break for these poor creatures, 
and they are unable to escape this valley which they are confined in. Will they survive? Who knows? It is a new dawn, and a new horizon, but still the pools have begun to shrink. However, there is someone new here in this desert landscape. Someone uninvited. These playful little creatures, known as Lystrosaurus, are the cattle of the Permian. Once in their thousands, these creatures live throughout the Permian and Paleozoic, dominating the land. This smaller variety has stumbled upon the water source, but still, the Demetrodons are stalking. They will not go down without a fight, especially not to these little guys. Waiting out the Demetrodons to see their next move, they have had enough and will go over to the water. Whether they die, whether they live, they know they must get to the pure, life-giving thing that is water. This elder, with many years of experience, is sick of it, and as he enters the pool, he feels the cold rush around him. He is for once at peace. The Demetrodons catch on and begin to stand up. Yet it is too late and the Lystrosaurs flee the scene. Full bellies full of water, these adorable little creatures are gone and the Demetrodons left meal. Yes.